with the clock racing towards a shutdown at midnight. Saturday, the House managed to pass a short-term spending package. The American people have won. The extreme MAGA Republicans have lost. In the end, all but one Democrat voted yes and 90 Republicans voted no. Democrats came to the rescue. The package produced by Speaker McCarthy at the 11th hour would keep the government running for another 45 days. It includes disaster relief aid, excludes Ukraine funding, and maintains current spending levels. A deal breaker for some Republicans. We have a conference that wants to continue the same garbage that is happening over and over again. For weeks, McCarthy tried to appease conservative demands to dramatically cut federal spending. But Friday, many in that same group voted down a package which included those very cuts. Not passed. The pivot to work across the aisle could cost McCarthy his speakership. Florida Republican Congressman Matt Gates promised to call a vote to oust McCarthy if conservative demands were not met. If somebody wants to make a motion against me, bring it. Without a deal, millions of government workers and military families would stop receiving paychecks and many services would be paused. There has to be an adult in the room. I am going to govern with what is best for this country. The pressure is now on in the Senate to act and get a bill to the president's desk. In Washington, Raquel Martin.